A lot has changed as the Department of Work and Pensions over the years. A recent Common Select Committee uh, review or question series led the Minister for Employment, who had only recently been put into position, to point out that they are looking at undertaking changes. They're looking at bringing in Skype or VOIP options for clients to actually use to make contact with a job centre. This could actually save quite a lot of money for people who are involved with signing on. They're also really putting the work coaches into the area where people on universal credit are actually searching for better paid employment. So instead of just taking the first job that comes along, as many people used to, they're actively encouraging job seekers to um, go into the work, but then to look for the next best job to take that career ladder up. Now, how much of this is talk and how much of this is going to be reality is something else. But with an additional 3,000 of these coaches coming on board within the DWP, they clearly see this as a clear way of getting people up the ladder and are off universal credit completely, which for many people would be lovely if they could achieve that. But the economy doesn't always necessarily tie in with that. So I'm hoping that if you're in a situation where you're going into the Job Centre Plus and, and you're thinking, well, actually, once I've got the job, that's it, be encouraged, look at this universal credit issue and see if it's something that you need to look at more closely and to engage the Job Centre with. See what sort of service they're providing. If they're not providing that service, then clearly your local MP could be the key.